I've been thinking about the word for today. It's from Psalm 27 verse 4. And it says, One thing I have desired of the Lord, that will I seek, that I may dwell in the house of the Lord all the days of my life, to behold the beauty of the Lord and to inquire in His temple. You know, I love this scripture because David talks about his one desire, which is to be in God's presence, to gaze upon His beauty. Because in the presence of God, there is a fullness of joy and pleasures forevermore. And in this season of our life, and I encourage you, make that your one desire, your one thing, to be found in His presence. Because in the midst of chaos, in the midst of uncertainty, His presence will give you fullness of joy, pleasures forevermore. And I just remember there's this one time when my kids were really young. Um, it was a long day, uh, it was bedtime, and I, I was just in, in my study, just trying to be in God's presence. It was so tiring, I could not even utter a word, I could not worship, I could not speak anything. All I could do was just stay in silence, to think about His beauty, and to gaze upon who He is. And I remember the boys were running, I could hear tiptoeing of feet and coming in, and they were asking, Dad, what are you doing? What are you doing? And I just said, I'm hanging out with Jesus. And they said, I want to hang out with Jesus too. And I said, okay, the condition is you have to stay here in utmost silence and not say a single word. And you know what? For little kids, one minute of silence is like insanely impossible. And they did that. And we had the best time of just silence in worship, in God's presence. And I encourage you to do that this week. One desire, God's presence.